Welcome back to Minecraft. I think this is um, part six or seven. So today we are going to be doing a little tour of our new library. This is I like this little design. It's took quite a while to do, but it's quite nice. Um, still not quite finished. Some pieces here and there that needs to be done but overall it's pretty good I most of it is, needs to be done out on the outside cleaning up taking some little dirt off putting something else here maybe I might just leave the dirt there I don't know yet because it looks alright here with that dirt there and then there's I suppose this side here don't take this one off of here and just leave that there maybe looks better that way because this has got the um double layered of this dark wood this window I like this little design here this big um, wooden beams there. So just look inside. You can see, see, as you can see, there's uh, some interior design done, which I'm quite happy with. So we're going to be taking a look at that as well. Obviously upstairs as well. Now if we look over here, we've got some new buildings going on here. Which has like houses at the moment. Not quite finished, so I'm not going to get a tour of that yet. We've got some kind of zombie somewhere around. I don't know where they are. That needs to come out there. Put one of these there. There we are, that's better. You see, I think. Yeah. Probably bring, bring this bit of that out just to equal that over there maybe later so that, I'm doing that now just leave a little bit of a gap on that side do that there take cover that bring out a little tad we've got a little bit of a hole there so we've got to cover that up as well see on the other side same thing interior over there So it's not too bad. So let's go inside quickly. So this is the indoors. These um, oak solid doors with the um, windows on the top. As you open up, it's what your grease is with. Yes. This is beautiful. Got this um, tile blocks tile box over that wall that goes away way through up to the stairs there was some pictures on the wall as well just to brighten it up a little bit and a chandelier type thing which is the um, fencing and the end rods just looks a little bit better gives us a little bit more of a brightness that's what I was thinking about. We've also got some lamps on the side. These go throughout the building as well. Let's close this door. I had to use these block windows because I can get the other windows to line up to this. Doors gives a big gap. Which is okay. She could have brought it up a whole this whole building up by another block or two just to you know, just give a another beam underneath here just to give us a little bit more of a room for our proper windows but that's all right now it's not too bad it doesn't look too out of place if you don't look up too much so these um lamps they're made out of uh what is it again find them yep 
stickers. The um, Prasmina blocks slab. I think that's Prasmina or Prasmina or something like that. Something like that. I think these were the starfish cobblestones, I think. Or silverfish, yes. No, no, it's not silverfish. Can't remember now. What was it? I've doubt it somewhere. Where was it? Um, ba -ba -bam -bam -bam. It must have been on the other one then. Terracotta? It wasn't wool, was it? Didn't make it out of wool. No, it's not some wool. It was one of these anyway. One of these. Not that one, no, that one. Can't remember which one it was. Should have written it down, really. <laughs> oh well. Put out sometime. So, yeah. A mystery block with a end stone, I mean an end rod and a slab up top just to brighten up. This is, this is, these are all over the place just to make it look uniformed. Again with the um, glass on top of the root just to give a little bit more light and a more design feature so you got like a, you can see inwards a little bit. Then we're coming to the first bit. As you see, we've got a little gap in between the between floors, just to make sure so people can see in and out. And it makes it a little bit more lighter as well, so it's not too claustrophobic. Got bookshelves throughout the length of the building, all the way over here. Also got some ladders up here, just to make it look like you can move them. So you get up to the top shelf. So you can know you can't get up. Just climb up here and just get a book. Again, lamps all over the place. We've got these tables and chairs made out of um, scaffolding and the trapdoors, <coughs> which is effective. A little bit too big, but oh well. What can you do? Not a lot. That's how it is. That's how Minecraft is. Uh, not a lot going in between these, just uh, some lamps here and there. Got some more pictures and some flower pots, some flowers in it. Again, just to make it a bit more bright. Don't know why we've got that there, we don't need it. <laughs> and we've got like, like a sofa here with, um, it's made out of the wood. The wood stairs, but it's safer really, so you can sit here and you know just have a nice relaxing read or something. Look out the window to the shop. Not much of a view, but it's okay. So that's the this side. Same side thing happening over to this side with the books shelves, but just a little bit more of a different design layout. Where we just got some more different type different. Table and chairs layout, singles, some doubles here and there, three over here. So it's just not, it's got a little bit more areas to sit down in. Got four here, and it's getting a little sofa and a creeper walking around. Trying to stay out of the sun. Um, that's about it for this room. I've got some more pictures, but we didn't put any, um, Let's take this one out again. No sh books, shelves going up the side of it. Just a. There's a little bit different area here. But it's mainly the same layout, out, lay out as the other side, apart from some seating areas some here and there dotted around. I've also got this little door with the sandstone, I'm going to say. And so stairs, I think it was. <coughs> yeah, these ones here. And stone. There. Nearly. <coughs> Sorry. 
past these glass stones up here and a door that leads out to this way, which is a nice little view out here you can see him quite lovely so now we're going to go upstairs just a quick upstairs and then we'll just go outside for a little bit oh, we don't really need to go outside so you know, just to show, show you around up top of here got a nice this carpet purple carpet going throughout the top of the area I think that's a lovely view here of this this, video, this window which I love didn't get the um two bit of corners there because of the what should we call it stones the step stairs so we just got this area here it's not too bad don't worry about it can't see the other view over there because that sandal is in the way but once it's a really nice little view because once the um sun rises you can see it beautifully from this view here great and it just goes straight up past this window like it was um made especially for it but it wasn't just an accident accident that I put it right here it's a good thing I did it's quite nice so also we've got these um little doorways with the windows again okay I might change some of these colorings because it's a bit too yellow because I use yellow pretty much everywhere so we've got these balconies on top here so you can come out and have a nice view you can see it with the wind that's it's just quickly uh, could get through open that door you see got the moon let's put that in the same to context as the sunset and that's beautiful view beautiful as I was saying coming out here got these um the logs are here just I was maybe put it lighter but I wanted it a bit more dark it got them on all four of the windows the front windows and the back windows so you just come out and have a look hang out in here and see what's going on in the world see the little castle over there and the river and the mountains and everything before we change it let's quickly close these doors don't want to let the chill in so as we got up here we've got some lamps and we've got some sofas made out of the ender blocks I know I'm in blocks okay should of wrote those down red never blocks that's what they are and red never blocks and some of the slabs of the wood slabs just like a little like a table there again okay, have a table up here I have a chairs up here but it's not too much going on up here um, this ceiling is made out of the sandstone one of these stand sandstones it's not a smooth one but it's a yeah this stand sandstone because it's got really good bottom on it that's got this like really good effect on it you can climb on it on it just to make it look like it's been moulded, something like that. Here we've got these um, the lamps with the rhinestone up in the top. It's not rhinestone, it's just stone. I'm on about up the top, which you saw me put in. So it gives you a little bit more light. Not a lot, but it's a little bit more. So yeah, you come out this door. And as you see, we've got this big gap here. Where it doesn't meet up. Okay, could have just lifted up <coughs> another block and but uh, a lot of blocks, a couple of blocks around here, layer of log blocks, windows and log blocks on the game, but it was too late when once I put it in, so it's alright. It's okay, it's not too bad. <coughs> See, so come out here and you can look at the view of our clock tower and shop and some houses not much of a view but 
Hey, oh, is what it is. Used to be able to see the mountains. I think if you come over here, you can just about see one. Oh, well. this was built before these mill. These buildings were in the storyline, so you can't tell what the future is. So, as we go along this little um, area, we've got the picture frames with a little bit of pictures in it. Some heads and some taris, pal talismans and shells and all that stuff. Some s little coral things and something. A little clock here, you can see uh, the time. Which moves, this is weird. Then you come to here, got your next like balcony with a uh, window and you can see it little um, mountain from this room for now until we put a roof on here we can't see anything then <laughs> as you see it gives you the idea that this was built before the buildings in front of it was built so yeah it's not too bad of a view Really, you can have a look out, see if anybody's coming, which they are not. So, go into the last room, which is this one here, same as the other one. Apart from we've got these um, sofas along this side of the wall instead of the. I still keep hearing those. There's somewhere around there. No, that's them over there. Don't know where he is. There's somewhere around. And we've got a map as well. Which we're gonna cover this whole wall with, but not up top, just the lengthways. Maybe might move that into the centre. Got a little flag as well. Yeah, pretty cool little area. Not too bad. Okay, I think go back to the beginning. We're not back to begin, but we're back here anyway. Back down to the start, that's nearly all of it. So we come out the back. I'll get for the doors if we can. Door again, don't let people go through. And we've got this little walkway down to the river. As you can see, all the way down here. So you can have a nice little look at the sea, at the river, and the tower that's going off there. It's perfect. Just perfect. So, in the next video, I'm going to do something else. I'm going to try to do something over this way, which is a lighthouse, which was already started over this area over here. And a little mount, a little rock over here. There's a, we haven't started, just put a little bit of a layout. It's starting to rain out. That's great. Also put a little bit of a... I was going to put it there. But I changed my mind to put it over there instead. So I put a little wall brick walls around there and then soaked up the um, water. So I take it out. I didn't decide not to use it instead. <laughs> Wasted my time really. But I'm going to do something really good there. I might be there some kind of statue or something. Or some the kind of add a bit of a harbour thing. So I might bring do another like a thin line of blocks to soak that out. Again. Maybe. Don't know yet. But this is going to be where the lighthouse is. Right here. Where the snow is currently. Always snows this part. Nowhere else but that part there. And we've got a visitor. We've got a couple of visitors actually. We did have a, a chicken up here a little bit a while ago. But I think he went away. Don't know where he went to. Ah, oh, there he is down there again. I put him up there, but he's down here again. Idiot. We've got some lava down here as well. So, alright. Give you some extra light. So, as you see, it's going to be quite a big one. Big build to do. 
also got to have a, a light on top that rotates how far it's going to go it's going to go pretty far pretty much and about here so you can see it pretty much everywhere apart from this area here because you've got this walking away maybe a little bit higher I don't know yet Let's see how it goes see how it goes so that's pretty much it for now you still see the tower there which is pretty good so you can come in here see this lighthouse come to this duck when you roll right right rowing in your boat <coughs> and you get to see the tower as well get close to this bit let's put a harbour here yeah, put a harbour here duck up this harbour Dush. and you get to see the lane there she is perfect so that's what we're going to be doing the, the, the high the lighthouse next time then I'm going to do a tour of the high lighthouse Probably the tour of the um, houses over there, but it's not really much interesting happen over there yet. Build up some more of the town area with some more buildings, loud plans. Yeah, it's coming along. It's not too bad. So I will see you in the next video. So goodbye for now. Goodbye. Thank <laughs> you.